Welcome to OC Realtors video library series. Today's video will go over how to create a quick search in the MLS system. Once we're logged into the MLS and we need to find properties quickly and easily, simply move your mouse over to the top and click on the word search. From here, this will now open up all the available different property type searches that we can make in the MLS. Today, what we're going to do is run a detailed search under residential in the MLS to find properties. Now what we can do is select our available statuses by simply clicking on the box next to the status. Today what we're going to do is we're going to look for active properties. If there is a field that has multiple choices, simply select a choice in that multiple field. If I need to select multiple choices in a field, simply either hold on your control key if I'm a PC user or hold down your command key if I'm a Mac user and now simply select the other choices within that field. If I need to deselect something because I selected something by mistake, simply hold down either the control key if you're a PC user or your command key if you're a Mac user and simply reselect to deselect. One of the nice things about our matrix system is that if we select nothing in that field, the system automatically assumes that you are looking for everything in this field. When it comes to our cities, instead of going up and down this field to find a city to select it and then hold down your control key or command key to select another city, simply instead, the white box that appears underneath the word city, simply click to get your cursor to blink and now tape, type in the name of the city that you wish to run your search for. To select the city officially while your cursor is blinking, all you would need to do now is simply type a comma after the name of the city. So now what we can do is type in multiple cities, just separate them out with commas and no spaces. So in this case, I'm typing in Irvine, comma, and now I'm going to type in another city, Costa Mesa, comma. Now I have selected both Irvine and Costa Mesa that are active to look at more than, or to look at 323 matches. Over here to the left hand side, the number fields. If I am looking for a particular price, I can just simply click in the box and now with no commas, decimal points, or dollar signs, simply type in the number. In this case, maybe I am looking or my client needs to look for properties at $950,000. Simply type in 95. 0, 0, 0, 0. Now we can see here on our number of matches that we have two matches that are in Irvine Costa Mesa that are currently active at $950,000. In cases where your clients are looking for, for things above or below a certain price range or in between, all we need to do is simply type in in our keystrokes the following. If I'm looking for everything above $950,000, simply type in $950,000 and follow it with a plus sign. Now we have 213 matches that are currently active in Irvine and in Costa Mesa that are equal to $950,000 on up. If I'm looking for everything below $950,000, simply type in $950,000 and follow it with the minus sign. Now we have 112 properties that are currently active in Irvine and Costa Mesa that are 950,000 on down. Typically, clients are looking for properties in between a price range. So simply type in your low number, follow it with the minus sign, no spaces, and now put in your high number. So now we have 55 matches that are currently active in Irvine and in Costa Mesa that are between 850,000 to 1 million. This is how you want to type in your number fields. Now to note, one field that you want to particularly be careful of is your bath total field. The bath total field indicates how many total number of bathroom types are in the property. You may or may not know that there are four different bathroom types available in a property. We have full, we have three quarter, we have half bathrooms, 
and of course we have quarter bathrooms. What makes up a full bathroom is all four components, meaning that the, prop, or the bathroom has a bathtub, a sink, a toilet, and a shower. A three quarters bathroom has either a shower or a tub, a sink, and a toilet. A half bath typically has just a sink and a toilet. And a quarter bath typically just has a sink. So if we're putting in the bathroom total number here, say as an example, two plus, if I go to my results to look at the properties, I may actually pull up properties that are one, one three quarter bath and maybe one half bath. Total number of bathrooms on the property is two. So in cases where your clients are requiring that they have at least two full bathrooms, please make sure that you put it under or you put that number under the full bathroom search. That way you pull up the appropriate number of bathroom types in the home. Now with our number of matches found, to look at the properties, simply click on the results tab in the top right corner or the bottom left corner, clicking on the results tab here. This will now open up and let you look at the results that you found from your search. I hope you've enjoyed today's video on how to create a quick search in the MLS system. For more information and videos, please feel free to go to our website at www.ocrealtors.org. Have a great day.